Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's project is all about DIY bow ties for your four-legged friend. So let's jump right into it. The first thing that you're going to need is some fabric. I bought these fact squares at Walmart. Some hair ties, some hot glue, and the hot glue gun. And then you're also going to need some scissors. So step one, open up your fabric depending on how much you have and figure out about how wide you want the bow tie to be. So that was about how wide I wanted it. Then you're going to want to figure out how high you want the bow tie to be. So that's about how high I wanted it. I folded it into thirds. Now you want to kind of test it out, but you want to fold two towards the wrong side on your thirds. So essentially you're just making like, it's kind of like a science fair board where they both kind of fold in over each other and you want to have that overlap. That'll help make it better. Then you want to fold one end into the center and then the other end into the center and make a little kind of rectangly piece. Now the next step is to make that middle portion that's going to go over that kind of center knot where you're going to glue. So you just want to kind of eyeball the strip. You can make this as thick or as thin as you want. It's all about look for bow ties. And you're going to fold both sides in very similar to how you did the third fold on the other ones. And now you're all set with your pieces. Now let's get to assembly. First, you're going to want to figure out how to fold this. So you're going to fold it in half and then fold the other two sides up like an accordion style to make your bow. So fold it in half, other sides both up towards the center like an accordion. And that gives you your bow tie shape there. Pretty easy. So now you're going to grab your hair tie and the first thing you're going to want to do is hook down these two pieces so the bow tie doesn't go flapping too much. You want to stick that down and that's going to be the front. The back is going to be where the middle, where there's kind of a dent in the middle. So make sure you hook everything together and then you're going to flip it over to where, um, wrong side, Whitney, flip it, there we go. Where the dent is in the center, that's where your hair tie is going to go. So you're going to fold, essentially have the hair tie be glued in the center and come up either side. So I put a dot of glue, inserted it, pinched it down and then fold the two items up. So you kind of want to pinch and pull at the same time because you don't want your glue to expand and then hook that down because then you can't hook it to a collar and that's a pain. So kind of pinch and pull till you get it where you want. And then you're gonna measure the center piece. You probably made it too long like I did, but you'd rather have it be too long than too short. You can always trim it. And then that just goes around the center to kind of hide, especially on the back where you kind of glued that hair tie. Um, and the nice thing is these hair ties match the bow, so they kind of bend, blend in a lot. Um, but I folded that end over just to ensure that I had a clean edge and then glued that up. You're going to want to hold on to it super tight for about a couple minutes just to make sure that's glued, but that's it. Now, in addition to this one that I made for Mr. Stanley, I also made a really cute Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle one, which turned out awesome. And I also made a larger green one and a larger blue one for when he grows and doesn't need a puppy sized bow anymore. So now for the assembly. All you have to do is take the collar and slide it through both of the two hair tie loops. Which is nice because it gives them give if they're like wearing it and like moving around. Um, that helps a lot. And then all you do is clip it on and it's seriously super simple. She wanted these for pictures for him to kind of announce him, say I got a dog, things like that. And I think it turned out so cute. He is such a cute dog and these bows just make it just, I mean, dogs with bow ties, super, super cute. So Mr. Stanley looking really good in his bow tie. He now has four options that he can rock on a regular basis, which is great. So hopefully you guys found this tutorial helpful and that you're gonna use it on your four-legged friend. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And also be sure to subscribe to my channel for more DIYs coming up soon. Thanks so much for watching, bye.